530, a hard won battle to preserve a haunting but impactful memory of loss and recovery on the ridge. Action News Now reporter Christian Lopez shares one woman's story. Jewel Charney lived in a big, beautiful house here in Paradise for 26 years, and it was filled with things she loved and treasured. Here behind me, this chimney is all that's standing after the campfire, and now she is preserving it as a piece of Paradise history. Most of Paradise was wiped out, and most of what we have here is, gonna, is new. I strongly believe in preserving history. I never really planned on becoming a part of it and having my house burned down around my chimney, but... Since it did, I decided I'm, I would eventually preserve it and restore it. She says she fought a long battle to be able to keep it. The town eventually letting it stay with the condition she built a three foot foundation. Chimney stands tall, it stands proud. It doesn't allow bureaucracy or even a fire to knock it over. Yeah, they're meant to have fires on the inside, but they're not meant to be in houses that burn down. And mine did, and mine stays. Charney plans to keep the chimney the way it was when it was burned during the campfire. But this foundation you see here is new and it was put in last week. And she also plans to incorporate some wood from an award-winning tree on her property. The tree, it stays also as a monument. That tree itself, it was a, a Doug fir, it won an award for being the largest fir tree on the entire ridge about 25 years before the fire. Charney says it's not just about the structure, but what it stands for. I have made be like a chimney my personal mantra. Because if you are like a chimney, you can withstand any fire that life throws at you. Charney says that she hopes to have the chimney ready in a few months and eventually be able to open it up to the public to get a closer look. And she is hoping that this unique piece of Paradise history will be a part of the town for years to come. Reporting in Paradise, Christian Lopez, Action News Now coverage you can count on. Charney has been staying in an RV on her property but does plan to rebuild soon.